On Sunday, December 18th, the new Holy Name of Jesus Church in suburban Harrisburg was dedicated and blessed by Bishop Joseph P. McFadden of the Diocese of Harrisburg. The ceremony began in the old church and was continued with a procession following the cross to the front door of the new church. At the door of the new church, Bishop McFadden was greeted by the builder who presented him with the keys to the new church. Once inside, Bishop McFadden blesses the church with holy water and delivers his homily, which touches on who we are as Catholic Christians and what the dedication of the church means. Today we celebrate the rite of dedication, and there is so much symbolism in this rite of dedication that calls to mind for each one of us, first of all, who we are and what this building is about. You see, while this edifice that has been built, this beautiful church now of the holy name of Jesus, actually this building is not the church of the holy name of Jesus. You and I, gathered in this space, are the church. You see, the church is not a building. This building is magnificent because it houses the body of Christ. You and I are the body of Christ. Bishop also anointed the altar with sacred chrism. Earlier in the week, we were able to speak with John DeSanto, president of Triple Crown Construction, and Father Edward Quinlan, the administrator for Holy Name Parish, about some of the joys and challenges they faced during the construction of the new church. This project for a lot of uh, the workers will be a once in a lifetime project, being able to do this type of project with this type of materials. And there's a story, uh, one of the carpenters was working under the stained glass window that uh, represents the Jesus workshop. And when he realized he'd been working there all day, he was overcome with emotion and really, I think, connected with the project. And we've had a number of instances like that. We were very fortunate in being able to pick up a number of pieces that um, really are very difficult to reduplicate today because of the, the precision and, and the artistic work that goes into them, such as the marble work that's in the sanctuary, the altars and, and the other parts, the, the stained glass windows, the stations of the cross. Um, these things, now. The, on the one hand, it's nice that it's available uh, because of so many places have had to close churches because of the, just the movement of population. They become available and we've been able to incorporate them into the structure. The good part is the structure itself was designed in that classical Roman basilica style so that these old and beautiful pieces look like they fit. And I think in, by being able to secure the windows and some of these other things, we've brought a classic beauty and at the same time, because they came from other things that were closed, you know, it's not like buying them new. So it's, um, it's made it much more possible for us to achieve, I think, a, just a magnificent structure for the glory of our Lord. The new Holy Name of Jesus Church is the largest in the Harrisburg Diocese. The beautiful brick church stands tall, calling to passers-by along Route 22 and I-81 to join us and give praise to the Lord.